How you doing, man? Good, good. I need you to spend ten thousand dollars of my money. Can you do that for me? Absolutely. Yeah. I You're down. You okay, perfect. The Apple store is right there. I'm about to go either make someone's day or stress someone the hell out. Probably both. Time to go tell an Apple store employee they've got $10,000 of my money to spend on whatever they want. For me though, don't get it twisted. They don't get to keep it. How you doing, man? Good, good. Uh, I have a bit of a special request for you. I need you to spend $10,000 of my money. Can you do that for me? Absolutely. Yeah? I You're down? You with that. Okay, perfect. Yeah. He took it pretty well. I walked in, I was like, I need you to spend $10,000 of my money. He's like, Okay, <laughs> makes sense, I guess. So that's probably what I would say. So he's gonna get uh, like a pro person and they're gonna do it because they know the products better or something like that. We'll see what they come up with. I have no idea what we're gonna get. I'm very scared, but we do it for the video. Oh, okay. Would you not be scared? Yeah, yeah. yeah, exactly. Even if we get great products, I'm still scared. Please, please smash the like button on the video. Coronavirus. <laughs> gotta, gotta stay protected. Okay. All right, the guy's inside right now. I can't see what he's doing. I don't know what he's getting. He's got my credit card and he can do whatever he wants with it. So this should be interesting. Again, I have no idea what's going to come from it, but we are going to give away some of it to you guys and to some strangers in some upcoming videos. So comment down below what videos you want to see us use all of these crazy products we're about to get in the... F Did that make sense? I'm losing it. I'm kind of nervous about what's going on in the Apple store right now. Okay, he's standing right at the iPhone. I need to stop looking at it. Corona, Corona, Corona. So we had to send in one of uh, the team in with him to like approve everything, even though he's essentially just gonna say yes to whatever he decides he wants to buy. But now they're having a long convo. It makes me think they're scheming. And my colleague that is in there is just picking things that he wants. It's like, yeah, I want this, I want this, I want this. And maybe giving him, I don't know, I'm getting paranoid. He's like, yo, how about this? We spend 10 grand, you finesse a one, two, we say it's more than it actually is. I'll keep one iPhone, you keep another iPhone. We all walk away happy. That's what I would do. <laughs> I think they got Jay. He's been in there for like 10 minutes. I said, go get an update. Why does that take 10 minutes? I don't understand. It, maybe I'm getting paranoid and losing my mind because I'm just sitting outside, like still on this bench. I still don't know why I did this. 10 grand. This is easily the most we've ever spent on a video. Like, not even close. I have problems. Look who decided to show up. I can't show you yet. <laughs> it's been like 20 minutes. What are you doing? Over budget? Stop. You're trolling. You're just trying to stress me out. You swear? How much over? $20. $20? Oh, okay. That's fine. I thought you were about to say 2200 or, well, even... I don't know. <laughs> By the way, guys, I found this company that's making a Tesla cyber phone iPhone. I'm gonna put it here. I want you to spam them on all their Instagram accounts. I'll put it down below. Spam them saying, send Sean the cyber phone or send at it's your boy the cyber phone, okay? You have the power, let's make it happen. Okay guys, we've got all of our bags. We spent, I don't know, where'd the receipt go? I don't know, we'll check when we get back to the office. Oh, holy hell, this is, <laughs> this is a lot of stuff. I'm trying not to look so I don't reveal to myself what it is. We're gonna head back to the office now and see what we got from our ultimate Apple genius created mystery box. What? That's a mouthful. All right, ladies and gentlemen, before we get into unboxing our Apple Store created mystery box, I gotta tell you about our sponsor for today's video. As you guys know, I buy a lot of tech for my video, this video being a perfect example, and it's starting to clutter the office quite a bit. So that's why I'm so excited to tell you guys about my partnership with Declutter. Basically, if you need to sell some tech, like I clearly do, and you wanna save the planet, the one place I go to is Declutter. These guys will buy your old phones, tablets, console. Is this even a, I don't even know. That's that's how much stuff I have and I really need to get rid of. But basically, they'll buy all of the tech you have, they'll pay cash, and they'll pay fast. It's actually a really good time to get rid of this, so I'm pretty sure there's a new Xbox coming out. The trade-in prices are actually really, really good. They pay up to 33% more than your carriers for your phones, and they definitely beat GameStop. And because you're dealing directly with Declutter, you don't have to worry about any auctions or annoying buyers who take forever to pay up. The process is really easy to use. Everything you make, you keep. There are no hidden fees. So basically, it's an awesome place to sell your old tech and it's good for the environment too so two birds one stone so to sell your old phones and other tech head over to declutter.com the link is down below in the description tell them what you want to sell they'll give you a price it's that simple plus you get an extra five percent value if you use my code it's your boy five for all of your tech then just ship your items for free and declutter will pay you 
you the day after they arrive. So if you wanna sell your phone, console, or any other tech you got, be sure to use declutter.com. Again, link down below in the description. So with that being said, let's get back into the video and see what we got in our Apple mystery box. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back from our little Apple experience extravaganza where somebody, not me, spent $10,000 of my own money. I actually, do we have the receipt around here? We brought it all back. I kept my eyes closed, just like a kid in timeout. The team put it all in a bunch of boxes. So we've got a few little mystery boxes we've constructed. We've got one, two, Two, three, ugh, four. So this is our Apple mystery haul that we managed to get. I feel like $10,000 should get you more, but I guess with Apple products, we could have literally got five phones and it would, it would just be this big. So I guess this isn't too bad. But with that being said, we're gonna start taking a look and see what we got. As always though, we gotta give a big thank you to our in-studio audience. Thank you guys for coming today. They came out in full effect. You're booing. Yeah, they did leave, but they're back this time because this one's a banger. Understandably so, they're back in full force. Every single one of them is here. Maybe, I don't know, maybe there'll be a new person. We'll decide later. Let's get right into the unboxing, guys. If you're excited, smash the like button because some of these items are gonna be coming to you guys, all right? I guess I don't really need this. We didn't tape the boxes, we made them ourselves. All right, let's see what's inside. All right, first, I Ooh! We're starting off with a bang. I actually kind of wanted one of these. An Apple Watch, yeah. A Series 5 Space Gray Aluminum Case Black Sport Band. This is either gonna be a really long video or I'm gonna have to like break this into two videos because I feel like a lot of these things could be a video in themselves. Okay, we've got Sport Band, Space Black Stainless Steel Pin, and the watch itself. Ooh, designed by Apple. This is just one big moment of satisfaction because every time I open an Apple product, I'm satisfied and I get to open a lot of Apple products today. Oh, this is interesting. This is new. Because it doesn't have a lightning port, you have to wirelessly charge it, which is pretty cool. So, boom, bam. Bada, well, it's already together. <laughs> right now, I'm just like in a shitty basketball hoodie that I wear from time to time, but I'm opening all this extremely expensive stuff. I feel like I should be dressed better for the occasion, but it's my studio. I wear what I want. Damn. Oh, you see the little little mini apple. I, it's probably gonna take me so long to set all this up, link it to my phone, do all that fun stuff and actually use it. But there is the Apple Watch. We have a lot more to unbox. So I'm just gonna jump straight into the next item. Oh, wait, all you gotta do is bring your iPhone near your Apple Watch? I guess it doesn't take that long. That was like three seconds. Some vibes. See, this is why I love the Apple products, baby. That and I, yes, have been brainwashed. I, I'll admit it. I'm not, I'm not too proud to admit it. Jay. You gotta be present, okay? We're in the middle of the most intense mystery box unboxing of all time. I don't know, Mr. Beast probably did like a $100,000 mystery box. This might be the most intense mystery box unboxing of all time. I'm claiming it right now. Next item is a Q-tip? A, a, a pencil, an Apple pencil. Uh, What is this? I really need to know how much an Apple pencil is. <laughs> I, I know, but just the fact that they call it a pencil makes me feel pain about knowing how much this probably costs. Cause we all know a pencil is like a dollar. We don't need to open it. We're gonna leave it there. I knew it was gonna happen. I just didn't know when it was gonna happen. We've got the iPhone 11. It's just the stock iPhone 11. Pop this open. Oh! Sorry guys, I literally just did this the other day, but it still feels amazing. The iPhone 11 came with a lot of options for colors. We got black of all the colors. Now we can kind of do a comparison, the iPhone 11 to the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Is this what you bought for yourself, Jay? He, he, he does need a new phone, guys. Jay does need a new phone. Oh my God. This is so much money, fam. I get why we got the pencil. We got a brand new iPad Air. This is an item that I have never had. I've never had an iPad. I've been an Apple guy for ages. I just always felt like they were kind of useless. I don't know. Like, what do you really need an iPad for? Like an iPhone to me does everything an iPad can do that I would need. Maybe, I don't know, maybe, well, we have one now, so I gotta figure out something to do with it. Ooh! Oh my God, it fills the frame, fam. Space gray vibes. Fam, how does the iPad only have one camera? I already got fingerprints on this lovely iPad, but it's just so clean. I feel like there's not as much stuff for me to do with the items when I unbox them. Guys, stick around because we do have some uh, special crazy items at the end of the video, I've been told. They're in a separate box that I won't be opening till later. So if you wanna see that, be sure to stick around. We do obviously, I mean, we spent $10,000 on Apple, at the Apple store. So obviously everything we're getting is gonna be insane. So don't skip anything, cause who knows what we might find in there. Right, we We've got a bag. I haven't looked inside. 
It's like a what's in the bag challenge. Ah! Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Bang! It's a lightning digital AV cable. Fun, that's fun. Disappointed! Connects HDMI to your phone. Maybe you can put your phone on like a monitor or something. Maybe, I don't know, that could be useful. And then we got the AirFly Pro. Connect two wireless headphones to any headphone jack. Oh, so if you have an older phone, but you got the AirPods and you still wanna use the AirPods, you plug this into the phone jack and they can connect your headphones, but I guess you can connect two. So you could be listening to something and the other person you're with could be listening. That's actually pretty cool. 70 bucks for the... Next item, well, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna move on. Not Apple, switching it up. We got Philips Hue personal wireless lighting. That's some vibes. You can put it behind the TV, you can put it behind your monitor. The product requires a Philips Hue bridge to control. What's in the box? Not a Philips Hue bridge. Why would you sell them separately? It's 170 bucks. They are compact. Yeah, we could use this for the podcast. We could use this maybe to set a little vibe during the video. Some vibes? You see the vibes? Okay. We'll keep our top five items of the day. Apple Watch, iPhone, iPad, those are obviously winners. Lightning AV cable, how much was this? 60, $65 for a dongle. Oh, we got some more color related vibe creating items. We got the Nano Leaf Canvas. We actually also have the triangle version of this. I got that in a Best Buy mystery box video. And today we've got more. These are the square vibes and we can, I wonder if you can link them together. So it says here, touch enabled, real time music sync. So you can have it sync to your music. That's pretty lit. All right, next item. Getting paper cuts. We've got, Oh, the ember, I've seen this before. It's like a coffee mug that keeps your drink hot. Very, very handy. Let's take a look. I have my coffee right here. Barely hot, I need it warmer. The issue is I leave it because I'm going to do something and then I come back and it's cold. Don't have that problem anymore, am I right? Oh, this is lit. Oh, this is heavy. Charge before use. Dude, we're about to be a smart office in here. Everything in here, lighting, mugs, lighting, mugs. Probably some other stuff. Well, honestly, we'll probably find some more things as we go through this. Is all going to be smart, just like me. All right, I like this, this is dope. No one else in the office is allowed to use this. I'm locking this in as my mug. I wanna see nobody steal my mug to make coffee, my mug. Guys, I don't know if you've noticed, but Jay has kind of graduated. He's not just an editor anymore. He's also our behind the camera personality. Soon you'll see his face, one day. Now we have a new editor. Brady is editing. So you guys can start asking for a Brady face reveal before you've even gotten the J face reveal. We're just gonna turn into a face reveal channel. Okay, should I try pouring my coffee in it? See if it warms it up. Okay, we're gonna put it to the side and we'll see if it warms it up. Next item. All right, ready? Three, two, one. That wasn't as smooth as I expected. A wired video game controller for your phone? That's lit, what the hell? Now I can go pro in Fortnite on mobile. And a console controller price, 70 bucks. I did this to myself. I'm getting kind of warm because I've been moving around, the lights are hot, but the shirt I'm wearing underneath this, it's kind of like, it's not embarrassing, it's just, it's funny. <laughs> I, I am, I am, yeah. They gave me a shirt when I went to the Lakers game. I had to, you know, we did a whole Apple video. I had, I had to bring some wish into it. All right, that's a little bit better. Still a sweater. Okay, let's check out this controller. <laughs> it's pinching. Oh, why do I keep hurting myself unboxing things? Download Ludo Map. Ooh, the app only has three stars. If this actually works, this is kind of a vibe because I could play games on my phone while traveling and stuff. And is my coffee warm yet? No, I feel like I probably have to hook it up to an app or something and then tell it to warm. Everything you gotta hook up to your phone these days. I think I should have done this before I filled it with liquid. Connected, oh, that was pretty easy. I gotta log in? All right, I'm at, I'm, it should be heating up now. See how that works. What, don't pause the Call of Duty download. It was trying to do kill two birds with one stone. Okay, next item. Is this what you got for yourself? Okay, well anyways, we got the Osmo Mobile 3 Combo. Basically, it's a steady cam kind of for your phone. So you put your phone on this and you can get wavy, you know, video footage, uh, Instagram stories. I don't know, shots of your kids. I, whatever, I, whatever people use their phone to get content of, you can use this to make it just a little bit nicer. So maybe my Instagram stories will be a little upgraded. Ooh, comes in a nice little clean package. 
This is smooth, bro. This is smooth. I like it. Oh, some handheld vibes. You can press record. There's a button on it. Press record button on it to switch to manual. I don't know what any of the other. I don't really know how it works. Want to get the iPhone 12? We can test this bad boy out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we set up the DJI Osmo. We hooked it up with our iPhone 11 Pro Max so we can get that high quality footage for you guys. We're going to test it out. Uh, as you can see, obviously it's very smooth catching some vibes you see it adjusting you can see the arm moving around but now there's a few cool little features you double tap the M power button here and watch this BAM BAM pretty cool eh? we got the joystick in the center which you can so you can stand still and tell it where you want it to go you want it to go up you want it to go down you want it to go all around okay so right now it's moving, it's slightly delayed. Like I'll do a big movement and it'll move, but it'll take a second. But if you want it to stay in the exact same position, you hold the trigger on the back. Okay, it still doesn't quite work. That's a vibe. Okay, and then the feature that I think is the coolest is the tracking feature. So we're gonna show you how that works. So I'm over here. The camera's right there, set up on like a little tripod vibe. That's how we're using it. And Jay is going to set it so that it tracks my face. And when I move, it follows me. All right, ready? Slow vibes! <laughs> Falls me down. No, it lost me. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Bam, wow. Oh, no, it lost me. Okay, I'm going a little hard on it. So now that we've tested it out and you can see what the DJI Osmo can do, you can make some pretty cool videos with your phone using this. And let's see what else our random Apple Store employee got for us today. Also, if you guys want us to do a more in-depth review of any of these items, be sure to let me know in the comment section. We just have so many things that it's pretty much impossible for us to really go ham on all of them. Otherwise, this would be like an 80 minute video and my coffee is warm. It's actually warm. It revived my coffee. Are you dumb? Okay, next item. Apple TV, yay! A classic, a nice little Apple classic. We do have a TV here, but I think we might already have an Apple TV. 229 bucks, is it really that much? Oh, it is, it's 4K. Pay for that quality, fam. That's what you're paying for. Ooh, oh, this one's heavy. All right, ready guys? On the count of three, enjoy. It's not as satisfying as the phone. Even the remote is a vibe. It's an Apple TV. I don't know what you guys want me to do with it, but pretty lit. I'll read you the uh, quick specs. How about that? 4K HDR, 32 gigabytes. That's about it. Pretty lit for 220 bucks, not, not cheap. I feel like I've been opening Apple products for three hours. Okay, let's see what do we have here. Ooh, some little GoPro vibes. Five, nine, oh, it comes with a GoPro. The GoPro Hero 8 Black, along with a few little accessories, as well as a Mophie power station and a Mophie wireless charging vent mount. I don't have vents on my Tesla, so Jay, Merry Christmas. This is all you get. I hate it here. You can have the power station too. A hundred bucks for a power station? 89, these things are crazy, bro. The power station looks pretty cool. 32 hours of charging for your iPhone XS, eight hours of charging your iPad, uh, or six hours of the iPad Pro. So it does give you quite a bit of power. 32 hours is just, it's a lot. Not bad. I'll give it a pass now. I thought it was over. But what I'm most excited about here is a new GoPro because we also got a wire cam. I don't know if you guys saw the last video, but we got this wire all basically cable camera system that we've hooked up in the office so we can have a camera fly from one side of the office to the other and it's typically supposed to be used with a GoPro we have hooked up an actual DSLR to it but I would feel a lot better knowing a GoPro was flying across on it instead of my $2,000 camera thank God the Apple store sells other products besides just Apple because it did make this video a little bit more interesting so you can just basically I don't know if you guys know but in the past the GoPros you would have to hook them up to I don't know how exactly but one of the accessories which would then allow you to hook that up to all the other accessories. But this GoPro has two little clips that fold down from here and you can use that to attach to any of the GoPro accessories right away, which is actually pretty lit. I just was saying, does it come with the waterproof case? Apparently it doesn't need it. It is waterproof right off the jump. Up to 33 feet. All right, man, we are like tacking out. Look at all this stuff. iPads, iPhones, Apple TVs, GoPros, Osmos. Bars, all kinds of different lighting setups. Maybe our, our gaming controller thing will finally decide to work. Probably not. We only had one item in this one. I think it might be a big, a big one. Is this the one you pick? Maybe. 
the DJI Mavic 2 Zoom. This is dope, but it's kind of illegal to fly drones in Canada. Like you can do it, but it's 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 a huge pain in the ass. But nonetheless, essentially to fly a drone in Canada, at least last time I checked, you basically have to be a pilot, like a real pilot. $1,700 for this thing? You can't even use it. Why is it so expensive? DJI, if you're watching this video, you can send me some of your products as well. Apparently we're going ham on the DJI products today. Oh, the Mavic Zoom, this is the big boy. What do we got here? We got a 24 by 48 millimeter optical zoom. You got a zoom built in, that's pretty lit. 4K video, 12 megapixel photo, omnidirectional obstacle sensing, eight kilometer video transmission, holy shit. And 31 minutes of flight time. That's quite a bit better. The one I had was 15. I think 15 minutes of flight time, a half an hour, and it goes up to 72 kilometers per hour. That's flying fam, holy hell. Maybe I should include this in the giveaway. Guys, let me know in the comment section, what items do you want me to include in the giveaway? Maybe we can give away the Mavic to one of you guys. I feel like that would be a pretty big vibe, especially you know if you don't live in Canada and can actually use the drone. Okay, like I said, there was some heat coming, so I'm happy you guys stuck around for it. I was just trying to make sure the camera's still running because we have been doing this for so long. What time is it, Jay? 10.21, we've been here for two hours unboxing. It took us two hours at the store for them to buy the stuff. Now two hours unboxing. We're getting there. We're getting towards the end now. So I think this might be the big surprise, perhaps. I don't know. Holy shit, are you kidding me? Oh, Tanner Fox is aged. They sell Hot Wheels at the Apple store? What? That's crazy. Hot Wheels uniquely identifiable vehicle. The smartest Hot Wheel track set ever. Play in the physical, level up in the digital. This is wild. I don't know if you can, can you control it? They have an iPad here and it shows like who's in first and who's in second. I don't know if there's some element of controlling this and you can make your car go faster. Smart cases, smart controllers, smart race tracks. I bet you weren't expecting that when you clicked on the video. We're gonna set this up, test it out and uh, probably never use it again. Unless kids come to the office. That sounded bad. Kids don't come to the... I want you to have a seat right there, please. Jay has a child. She might come. That's it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we set up our Hot Wheels track. It's time to test it out, see if it actually works. So basically, you press this down. It gives you a little... Why is it so slow? Holy hell. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, we got one going. Let's see if I can get two cars going at the same time. Fuck. Go, go. Oh! Oh! That's it, I give up. I was close, I got one round. Ow! All right, two at a time is, is, is very difficult. So I'm gonna just stick with one and we're gonna go check out our last couple products. That was definitely a surprise. We do have a few more items left in what is easily the biggest unboxing in the history of this channel and possibly YouTube. Said that like three times, but I just wanna reiterate it so that you guys feel obligated to like the video because why did I do this? I really don't know. You know, the other day I was like, I'm not gonna overthink it. I'm just gonna do videos that pop into my head. I'm sitting down, talking to everybody. I'm like, hey, what if we just went to the Apple store, gave one of the geniuses 10 grand and said, go to town. And everyone's like, ah, that'd be crazy, but that's like 10 grand. And I was like, yeah, that's a lot, but let's do it. And then I didn't really think about it anymore. What an idiot. I probably should have thought about it more and then we just wouldn't have done it. But hopefully you guys are enjoying the video because otherwise this was a huge, gigantic, massive waste of time. Okay, we've got our two final bags right here. So far, let's do a quick run through. This is, there's two items left. We've gotten an iPhone 11 an Apple Watch, an iPad, an Apple TV. We've gotten uh, controllers, GoPros, Mavics, drones, a bunch of lighting things. We got an Osmo, cables. We got little accessories. We got a lot, a lot of stuff, but I still feel like we didn't get enough for 10 grand. A pe we got a pencil, that makes it all worth it. But now it is time to see what our final items are. I'm guessing these are big items because, hey wait, didn't you say we got something for you? Is it? Is it one of these two? Is this finally the reveal of Jay's, the item Jay is hoping that I gift him after the video? All right, let's take a look at the first one. Smash like one. 
it's another iPhone. Okay, we got the iPhone 11. I think this is Pro. The iPhone 11 Pro. That means we a, a black one again. What is with this? I, I, I know the guy who we picked is it's very it's not too much variation. But we got another black iPhone 11, and that means. Oh, come on. That might be worth the whole amount that you pay for the phone. Oh, this one looks clean. Let's do a quick side by side. Is this gray maybe? Oh, these are different. I don't know. It's like two shades of black or maybe a gray. I don't really know. Still no AirPods. I can't believe they haven't put AirPods in yet. But I have heard that they're getting rid of the lightning port. Probably not in the iPhone 12s, but potentially the next version, they're gonna get rid of it. And then the only way you can charge your phone is by putting it on a wireless charger. I did see these like AirTag things. That might be a way of charging your phone. And then you would have to use AirPods, at which point they better put some AirPods in these goddamn phone cases. And it is now time for our final item of the day, ladies and gentlemen. I know I've said it a hundred times, but I think we deserve it. Please smash the like button. If we get over 50,000 likes, on this video, I will be giving away a lot of this, okay? So, it's my leg, you know, you know. Time for the final item. I missed it, okay. Oh, I think I know what this is. Is this what you wanted, Jay? The iPhone 13! Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, an iPhone 8. I don't even know this was a thing still. They sell this still at the Apple store? You got this for yourself. This is you sneaky little, you, you, can you give me an iPhone? <laughs> Okay, what? There's a little plot twist. We've got the iPhone 8, which is, this is before the iPhone 10, which is the one I have, the XR. Hopefully it wasn't too expensive. But now we have just all, all kinds of iPhones. And black again. What? <laughs> We've got all kinds of cool colors and we just get three black iPhones. God, damn Apple genius employees. He's trying to be safe. I understand it. You know, he was, he kind of felt a little uncomfortable spending all of our money. Still, man, come on. Spice up the colors a little bit. I didn't even do the peel. <gasps> Oh, I just peeled it off. I was so distracted. It doesn't deserve a peel. This is an eighth. Quick comparison. One camera, come on. What am I, a peasant? You can see the size difference. Pretty substantial. We could give this away. I would feel a lot easier giving away a nice iPhone 8, or maybe we'll use it in a video or something like that. But we did get three iPhones today. We got everything Apple. But with that being said, we techified the office. We techified my life. I still don't know what Jay was expecting to get from this because I'm obviously not giving him any of these iPhones. This house is a Prison! Unless, you know what, Jay? You tell them. Give them a light goal. If we get a light goal, then I'll give Jay the iPhone 8. Do you even want the iPhone 8? Jay's an Android guy. <laughs> Come on, Jay. You can do better than that. I gotta approve the light goal. 35k, and we'll give Jay the iPhone 8. It's all in the viewer's hands. Okay, no, wait, I got it. 35 for the iPhone 8, 50 for the iPhone 11, 75 for the iPhone 11 Pro, 100K likes, and we give Jay the iPhone 11 Pro Max. This is the only way we can bring Jay over to the dark side of iPhones. So be sure to smash the like button. Overall, I would say this is a pretty interesting video. We obviously snapped, but the plan is to use some of this in future videos for all of you guys who are going, holy hell, you just spent a shit ton of money that could have been used for something else. One, we're gonna be using it to do some giveaways for you guys. And two, we're gonna be using a lot of this in other videos. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. One of you guys is gonna have a chance to win some of this stuff as well. But as always, thank you so much for watching and i will catch you next time toodles be sure to subscribe please please subscribe by the way guys just want to remind you a big thank you to our sponsor for today's video declutter if you want to sell any of your old tech be sure to check out the link in the description down below